Hi everybody! Sorry for the delay. Let me just check everything. Right. There we go. Right, hi everyone, sorry about that. <laughs> Live streaming, it's brand new to me. Only done it a couple of times now. So please be gentle. Okay, so, uh, welcome everybody. This is The Adventures of Plum Pudding. She's a character I've played before uh, when I was playing on PS3, although I never completed it. And because of Ozzy's Road to Home Plate challenge that I'm doing, I'll let this play in the background while I'm at it. Um, because of Ozzy's Road to Home Plate challenge, which was inspired by this character, I thought, you know what, let's play for PS4, disable all mods, because my main playthrough um, isn't an ice witch, therefore I had to have a mod to get rid of the fire spells that hey, we start with. Finally awake. Um, hi Morph. The border, right? Walk right into um, so, I have decided to restart there. Plum Pudding. Storm was so... She's not the Gormand or anything like that. She's just someone who wanted to um, learn as much about the food and culture of Skyrim as she did about her home country, which we haven't established this playthrough. So, uh, her aim is to open up a chain of restaurants or inns around Skyrim. So You're that is how we are going to use Hearthfire. This God. isn't going to be a long Where stream today. Us? I'm not interested in the main storyline. I'm not doing any challenges. I'm just having a little bit of fun playing through Plum this Pudding. Anyone who wants hey. to drop in and, and say hi, you're more from, than welcome to. Um, and in the meantime, I'm just going to keep playing. So it's nice to have you morph. I'm from Rorikstead. Rorikstead, right. Maybe we'll head there at some point then. Good. Let's get this over with. Sure. Mara, Dabella, Kinnereth, Akatosh, the Vines, please help me. Well, not so much backstory, but plans for the future. So. And it looks like the Dalmor are with him. I wanted yeah, no, no. to try playing yeah, a character because my main character is Skardi, she's an ice witch, and she's very martial. And I wanted to try playing a character that wasn't so much and it's see how heavy. far I could go. And I used I to be used part to of a few groups on, on um, Reddit and things like that. that and there was parents. one, the Tamriel Vault, I don't know whether it still exists, Funny. and when they do character builds walls, and I thought that was brilliant and there were some really good character builds so I wanted to try them out oh bless Why? I'll be right back guys inside the house now Whoa. yes papa get these prisoners out of the carts move it why are we stopping why do you think end of the line so, any questions, just ask. Let's go. So, poor Morph is on holiday and having a belt in time, drinking and eating and sunbathing, and is now sunburnt everywhere. Poor old Morph. We weren't with you. This is a mistake. Step towards the block when we call your name. One at a time. Empire loves their damn lists. Ulfric Stormcloak. Jarl of Windhelm. It has been an honor, Jarl Ulfric. You hurry to your doom, don't you? Rail you rail off. Riverwood. So, 
so the plan is no to be female because no, um, I find it a lot easier Oh, else? poor old look fight? here of Rorik's dead. Wait. And I bet you nobody there. tells his that family. <laughs> so, I'm not entirely certain what race to Who be. are you? Let's go... Um, getting used to the settings again. I used to be Breton when I was plum pudding previously. So, shall I do that again? I think I will. No dirt because she's um, very clean. Let's have a look at the presets, shall we? That one. This is the Bretons, is it? Oh, they all look very angry. Alright, okay. Do you know what? We're probably going to leave her pretty much as is. change the hairstyle I think okay if we do that and then so my playthrough on Fallout 4 is a character called Ambrosia and I don't really want to recreate her, so we'll just do that. Yep. Okay. Right, how do I name her? I've completely forgotten how to do this. There we go. So yeah, this is just going to be a very, very quick playthrough. Probably just till we get to Riverwood. Are you from Daggerfall, Breton? Fleeing from some court intrigue? Captain. No, nope, you're right. I wouldn't be dressed do? as a knight. She's morph. not on the list. Forget the list. She goes to the block. By your orders, Captain. I'm, I'm planning sorry. to be non-martial. We'll sure so yeah, I'm sorry it was late. I um, couldn't find my disc copy and it turns out it's not a disc copy, it's a digital copy. But oh, it was on my husband's Stormblog. account, so I'm here and help not mine. Here. So I had to go but into his account and make sure it was activated on this PlayStation. So. It took a little while and then updates and you crikey, everything's so Blind crazy. I don't usually go for Breton either, I'm usually um, Norse, a Nord even, but I have played as a Khajiit a lot. It's nothing. Um, Carry on. Yes, General Tullius, give them their last rites. As we commend your souls to Ethereus. <laughs> Blessings of the eight divines upon For the love of Talos, shut up and let's get this over. As you wish. So I think we're all pretty familiar with how this starts. And there's a lot, not a lot of choice for me. I figure, having roamed the wilds and it being quite a feudalistic game, I will be well acquainted with hunting for food. So, a hunter-gatherer type, and I have some ideas for weapons I'd like in the future, being Breton. As fearless in death as he was in life. Next, the Breton! Right, I'm up. 
Wish me luck, people. Did you hear that? I said next prisoner. To the block prisoner. Nice and easy. Does anybody else ever get that feeling that the game's gonna glitch on them and they actually will die at this point and <laughs> not? <laughs> <laughs> what in oblivion is that? Sentries, what do you see? It's in the welcome, welcome, everybody. <laughs> and similar to Fallout 4, I have never finished this game. Uh, I spend so much time running around picking flowers and creating new characters. I would think that this would be the perfect time for them to cut the bindings on my wrist. But no. Right, so let's move. Let's go! Come on then, Rayloff, lead the way. Let's go. Oh, I love Skyrim Morph. I absolutely adore it. Look out! Because I love the snow and the winter. And uh, when I played Oblivion, Bruma. I just adored Bruma and I wanted a fireplace in the house in Bruma. Jump through the roof and keep going. Go! We'll follow when we can. Right, I'm just gonna get through this as fast as I can. Hammond, you need to get over here! Now! Data boy, you're doing great! Coral! Run, run, run from the dragon. Whoa! What hit me there? Well, I thought that was hit all over. <laughs> Um, I don't know whether you saw um, Wednesday Night Morph in my Road to Home Plate stream. I'd got almost all the way to Diamond City and you know you got that Super Mutants battle with uh, the Diamond City Guards. And I'm thinking yeah the Diamond City Guards have got this, it'll be fine. So I run in and... <laughs> Diamond City Guards didn't have it. Looks they were like so we're far from having it. it. They were absolutely slaughtered. And then that the Super Mutants gang up on me. One headshot up. and that's Just it. Like Boom. I'm down. The, the harbingers of the end times. We better get moving. Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. So yeah. If you go back and watch Wednesday's stream. You need your hands free. There you go. May as well take on your gear. Okay. You won't be needed so, good news gear. I am going to take some comfy fur boots, and that's about All it. Right. Get that armor on, and get that axe a few. Because I've only got some rags, Wings. and we're not going to overload ourselves with a load of rubbish I'm yet. I'm going to see if I can find some way out of here. Ah, this one's locked. Let's see about that gate. Nope. Damn. No way to open this from our side. Ah. Come on, soldiers! Keep moving! Cover. Right. Get this gate open. Yes, you will enjoy it more. Oh, 
and I know I'm not going to get a lot of XP doing it this way. But that's not the plan. The plan is to roleplay the poor little Breton girl who just wanted to open her own restaurant and has got caught up in the middle of this weird civil war. Come on, Rayla, finish him. Maybe okay. one of his superiors have the key. So you can take that. See if you can unlock that. That's it. Come on, let's get out of here before the dragon brings the whole tower. And down this on our heads. is where things start to get a little bit crazy because I'm going to pick up all the food. All the food. Pearl pudding. She just wants to be a successful restaurateur. Damn, that dragon doesn't give up easy. Grab everything important and let's move. Dragon's burning everything to the ground. Yeah, we'll take some wine because that makes the food go down better. It's not as good as salt and pepper more, but a little bit of wine doesn't hurt. And I think this is going to be the plan. Uh, for her to let somebody else do all the fighting for her. More food. But there's no way to cook here at this point, is there? Yes, let's go. I hear that. Does it come on? I'm not a warrior. Yes, I have mentioned my hubby. We will take the nice fur gauntlets. Grab it. Be useful and let's go. And we'll take the steel dagger. I do miss Oblivion's lock picking skill. That was a lot of fun. Right, I'm sure you won't mind me. Wearing this dead dude. I have been married for 20 years this year, Morph. It will be my 20th anniversary coming up soon. That one. So 
So what I'm doing is I'm trying to level up as much as possible knowing that I'm not going to be able to level up my martial skills. So the more lock picking and sneaking I can do, the better. And once I get a bow and arrow, I'll be a lot happier. <laughs> Come on, so, Morf is, um... I have been ma married for almost as long as Morph has been alive. I think that's the gist of it. Orders are to wait until General Tullius arrives. I'm not waiting to be killed by a dragon. We need to pull back. Sneaky, sneaky. And I'm not quite sure how long I'm going to run this playthrough for. Um, the reason for me actually doing a Skyrim playthrough rather than continuing my Fallout playthrough <laughs> is because I have a friend, another YouTuber, Jill Smith, and normally I watch her on a Friday night. She does an amazing Fallout Friday. You may not have seen it. You can always go back and check out her videos. She, um, she is Jill Smith on YouTube, all one word. And she keeps me very entertained on a Friday night. But she's not going to be able to stream for a little while. So I thought, one, to stop me missing her streams, and two, hopefully to... Oh, crikey, what a pause. <laughs> hopefully to entertain her. Um, because she's a massive Skyrim fan as well. So Let's that is why I'm goes. streaming Skyrim on Friday nights. So hopefully she'll be back soon, at which point I will go back to watching her Fallout streams <laughs> and Plum Pudding. I may find a different day for her. Um, it might be something that I continue on a Wednesday after Oz's home plate challenge is finished. So it could go either way. Yeah, it's all in her videos if anybody's curious. Right, so what else have we got? That doesn't go anywhere. Yes, we'd better try this way. Okay. Hmm. Oh, I hate it when this happens. There we go. Oh, rail off, you monkey. Too far. can take out animals, that's absolutely fine. Too many eyes, you know? mm. Do you know what? I am going to take this because I want as much to trade as I can. Now, I'm always sure there's five of them. There he is, hiding. And I am not going to go and scour everything. Come on, hurry up. Stop t 
telling me what to do. I know it's the tutorial, but he's just so bossy. Anyone would think I'd never played this before. And you know oh, what? There's a bear up there. Bear just so her. we are going to sneak his... Ah, uh, no we're not. First we're going to take right the coin it's first. Sneak by. Just take it nice and slow. And watch where you step. And that's a big coin purse. Or if you're feeling lucky. You 35 gold. Might take and her by we'll surprise. that. Go ahead. I'll follow your lead and watch your back. Will ya? He's going to follow my lead and watch my back. I bet I turn round and he's still way back there. Oh no, he's right behind me. Sneaky, sneaky. And back. And forwards. There we go. Rail off, man. Will you just move? Now, I've wasted an arrow. Thank you. That might be worth something. I really wish he wasn't a, an essential character. Oh. Sorry about that. Bit of a glitch there. Hey, Nicola. Right. Sorry about that. We had um, somebody signed into this PlayStation as well and they just signed into the other PlayStation. So, yes, we are a two PlayStation family. <laughs> And Morph, I can read what you're saying. Just be thankful that I don't have Nightbot because you'd have been banned for that. Oh, there it goes. There he goes. Right, like so I won't be going that way. Um, yeah, I'm going to get to Riverwood and I'm going to disgust you all by my filthy habits there and then I probably won't bother to talking to Gerda but then I'm gonna finish up for the night I should be hunting these little animals but to be honest I just want to get to Riverwood how are you doing Nicola have you been having a nice week so far or has it been pretty manic with the little one not a warrior and I'm not a mage so I'm going to go for that one because I'm go oh oh it has activated because I'm going to need to be stealthy to go hunting and let's get a wriggle on Normally I find a lot of mushrooms, but I haven't actually been looking this time. Right, where are these pesky wolves? There they are. Oh, oh, got to get used to this. And normally there's a third one. Oh, 
Oh, hello, Vailoff. You're a bit of a waste of time, really, aren't you? All right, it was down here. Or is it? Stop sneaking. Yeah, down here. There they are. Let's get some slaughterfish eggs. And there are some mushrooms here. Where are they? There we go. And there. Are the Khajiit here today? Or are they not? Not today. Right. A I saw a what? I don't think you did, you crazy lady. So, we take all the food. And then we are going to go and Here's cook it all up. Feindal thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. She's already mine, I keep telling him. Orgnar, are you listening? I think I've gone to the wrong Our place, haven't I? The ale is going bad. We need to get a new batch. Did you hear me? Anyway, so I am leveling up in Riverwood. Let's see what we're going to go for. Go for health because you have to straight away. And I think I'm going to go for archery. So we can do some good hunting. isn't it? We've got some salmon and all that kind of malarkey. What is it, woman? Drunk on the job again? There we go. What are you doing here? Ha. I'll be right down. Hmm. Ooh, mushrooms. I bet they'd go nice in a stew. I just want her key. Can I see your ads? How many girls have New to Riverwood? Of course. Oh, what's this all about? Oh, there we go. We'll take all that. Oh, I shouldn't have taken that. But I've done it now, so... In fact, you know what? Hush, Frodner. This is crazy not ladies do crazy things. So now I'm going to head to her house and cook some food up for my journey. Mm. That's right, um, Morph, I am going to be raising up my trading, shopkeeping, uh, hunting skills. So let's see. And I know this isn't so much a skill. I've used all the salt. Has she got any salt? Let's see what she's got. More wine, more bread. Glass. Interesting. Troll fat. Ah, oh, yoink. Oh, didn't mean that. They won't starve, they'll be fine. I'll leave them some food. They've got loads of potatoes, all right? Plenty of potatoes. Well, that's not stealing, is it? See, I'm just taking slices now. I'm not taking the whole wheel. No need to be greedy. See, I'm not taking that because that's stealing. Oh, 
Oh, what have we got in there? Nothing. I don't know what that is, but we'll have it. Um, what have I missed? Ah, I'll take one pheasant, one rabbit. No salt. Never mind. So take the chicken egg. Now sometimes by the time I get here it's dark already and under cover of darkness I get up to mischief. I've got loads of cabbage. Have I got any leeks? I don't think I do. I've got loads of potatoes, so I'm not going to nick all the potatoes. Right, so let's go sell off. The weapons. Is he out here? Ain't every day we get visitors and looking to protect yourself or deal some damage. Hi, Oxhorn. Welcome. So we are going to sell those because we don't want them. And we'll sell that and those because we're not interested in all that. Hi. Papa says I'm too friendly with strangers. But you seem like... Okay, so... The next thing I do, under cover of darkness normally, is I root through their bins and take all their food that they're chucking out. I'm not out to force anyone into starvation but that's a load of stuff they don't want so I'll grab it come on turn away who's looking at me is it that kid right and then I'm going to turn it into nice food Nice, tasty, good, honest grub and sell it back to them. Waste not, want not. We got rooms and food. Drink too. Ike, take a look. Right, we are going to sell Hmm. Not my meals. Right, well I'll keep my meals then and I will sell all that. Keep that. Because he'll only sell it back to Gerda and her family, so they're not going to starve. Oh, that's mine. Wonder where... Oh, I'm keeping those. Because I can cook the... Oh, I'll just sell it all. Right. Till next time. So all of that stealing, I don't want to steal.
exactly exactly one man's trash trash is another man's treasure and the thing is it's not like i'm serving them raw rotten food i am giving them what am i giving them i'm cooking it and serving them tastier food with their uh, leftovers now i can't remember how to go into third person with this because I've been playing Fallout for so long. No. Oh, that was daft of me. There we go. Put the weapon away. So there she is. Plum Pudding. Heading into the wilds of Skyrim to earn her fortune and set up her own little restaurant business. She's going to have a chain of inns across Skyrim and people will flock there from far and wide. So I'm going to cut it now and uh, remind you that I've got some build videos coming up and next Wednesday I will be streaming the second part of the first part of Ozzy's Road to Home Plate Challenge. Um, I'm not considering it episode 2 until I've actually got to Home Plate. So it's like 1.2 and then next Friday I'll do a bit more Skyrim, hopefully for a bit longer. and we will head to Whiterun and route through their bins, cook some food and serve it to them. So have a really, really lovely week and I'll catch up with you guys soon. Bye everyone.